So as you probably know, if you've been following my last like three videos that I was in Las Vegas for spring break. So we actually only went like out shopping one day, but then one other day we were walking through Planet Hollywood and they just four and we just walked in and I got one thing. So it really kind of going like shopping, but I didn't get that much on this trip, which is good. Every time I go out shopping, being like, I don't know what I'm looking for. Like I can't find anything. Cause I'm like, have that, have that, have something that looks a lot like that. Don't like that. Okay, well, hopefully this will be one of my last hauls for a little while. Maybe I'll take a break and get some money because I'm broke. There's like $30 in my bank account right now. It's not good. It's not good. It's not good. So the Mac Quite Cute collection just came out and I pre-ordered stuff and on our way to Vegas, we stopped by and got the stuff and like picked up the stuff that I pre-ordered and I got three things. The first thing is the mineralized blush in Shakura. The purpley mineralized blush with a magenta heart in the middle and it's so cute and I don't own any purple blushes and then I got two lipsticks the first one is in candy yum yum which is the most insane color I have ever seen I love this it's a neon color it's definitely gonna be fun to wear in the summer but it is like a bright a bright color and if you want like the true color of it it's like a neon blue based hot pink. So I would check Temptalia. I'll link um, on the, in the down bar, dim down bar, da, 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 down bar swatches so you can see what it actually like looks like. Playing koi, and it is um, a nude. It's a really peach based nude. It literally looks like a concealer color, and I, I I'm in love with it. I love it so much. It's on my lips right now. And what this color has done for me is it's a lot. It's done a lot for me. It's just done a lot for me. It made me start wearing lip gloss. And I hated lip gloss. I really did. And if I wear it sparingly now, I can. But for me, for this color, I never really understood when people are like, oh, nudes, you really need to wear a gloss over them. Because I tried it on and it looked like a questionable sub substance on my lips. Use plain koi and then use a lip gloss like Lychee Lux, which is a way brighter color, but it just looks so, so, so good. So this has actually got me to start wearing lip gloss. And I tend, I'm now starting to wear lip gloss almost every single day. I don't wear the kind where it gets like super, super shiny. I'll just put a little bit and spread it around, but I don't know. I really, really, really like this color and I'm so, oh, I love it. And I'm wearing this a lot in my Vegas vlog. So if I'm wearing like a really nude color, then that's what this is. So from a little random store at the outlet mall, I got these sunglasses. I'm gonna try them on because it's what everyone does. Yeah, I like big sunglasses. I look like a bug. It's like I'm in Bugs Life. I love that movie. So then I went to the Pack Sun outlet, and this is all at the Las Vegas North outlets, I think. And I got these pair. I got these pair. I got a pair of jeans. Um, they were 15 bucks. Excuse me. They are three long boot cut, but they're just um, like mid wash jeans. It's super cute and um, it fits me well. It's a medium. I wish I could have gotten it in a large, but uh, it has a clasp in the back, so it wouldn't have fit me around. It's a coral color and I absolutely love it for spring because it's super, super in for spring. And on top of that, it's neon. Like it's a neon coral, so I look a crap ton tanner than I actually am when I wear it. The matching bottoms because I thought like, hey, why not? It's a plain color. I'd like to. They're cute. And then we've got little folds over. It's cute. These are in a size small in case you care. Really like them. Super cute. And this all together, these, both of these, 22 bucks. 22 bucks for bathing suit. Cheaper than you can get them at Target. So my favorite buy of the day was from the Seven Outlet. Seven from Mankind jeans. In case you don't know what they are. And I'm going to have you guys guess how much these were because it was insane. Insane. Insane how cheap they were. Size 27. I'm typically like a 26, 25, but um, I don't really care. <laughs> but they're so cute. They're distressed, which I love, and they've got the little A pockets. So that's the style. And fun fact, they're petite jeans. Excuse me? If you're not familiar what petite jeans are, they're for like petite women. Like women who are like all around small, body small, height small. This girl's not small. There's there's a lot of Megan going around. I'm, I'm tall. I got long legs. I got long limbs. And these fit me. Like, they're long enough for me. They were $30. Excuse me? Um, originally, I think they were $2.49. And I got them for $30. Bucks. Oh, okay. 
I, I'm obsessed. I love them so, so much. If you guys don't know what CCO is, it's a cosmetic company outlet. They have discounted and discontinued makeup for Bobbi Brown, Lancome, and MAC, and a couple other brands. I don't really remember the rest of them. But you can get stuff from limited edition collections there and tons of stuff like that. These cost $10.25 instead of $14.50. And this first shadow is cut to fit. Just, um a reddish brown. This one is from the Star Flash collection. I know that because it says it. And this is Dream Maker. And it's just a yellowy based highlight. Super shimmery. Is it Straw Harvest? A orangey, peachy straw color. <laughs> I'm so creative! And this shadow is Shimmer Moss. And it's in limited edition packaging because it is from the To The Beach collection, which was out last summer, and it's got a little seashell on the front. Shimmery blue teal color. Oh my god, I absolutely adore it so So then I got my first mineralized eyeshadow, Tria, is that what it's called? I don't know, but it's mineralized eyeshadow, and this is in Blue My Mind. It's a light baby blue, a mid-toned blue, and a navy. And the middle color is very, very different from this color. This one's a lot more green-based. It's definitely more teal, and this is a more true blue. So if you ever to Vegas, a lot of the hotels are basically like hotels and malls and theaters and casinos. Like, they're literally massive. So Planet Hollywood has Sephora in it, and we were there for dinner, and I got my first NARS product. Oh my god. It's Torrid. It's so pretty and I have nothing like it in my collection. Definitely a coral. It's like a legit coral blush. Mars Torrid and this is Elf's Candid Coral. They're super, super different. This is definitely like more of a peach color and this is a more of a legit coral color, but yeah, creepy how alike their packaging is. But Nars is, has that feeling like the Velveteen Rabbit book. We've been over this before, you guys. I know I'm weird. So that is everything I bought in Vegas. So yeah. Um... I have nothing funny to say to end this. Hold on, Christmas!